Yeah, how's it going, guys? It's Richard Unicorn Caller, and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. We actually got a few things to uh, talk about. First things first, I am on, like, super early. Like, my time, it's, like, 9 a.m., because Jackson just had his uh, first kindergarten visit. So, yes, everybody's going back to school now. But we got some interesting things that has happened, and uh, was on the one. So, first things first, all these are pretty much active. The Pet Promiade as of when I'm recording, it has two hours left, and then the Summer Scroll of Fortune has one day left, but they've also introduced the Fall Scroll of Fortune. So this is the new one, and we're gonna check it out right now. So over here, these are the featured rewards right here. Myth Fairy uh, Gold Idol, pretty cool. Unicorn Jade is one of the new Maycast um, Jades. Um, I don't know if it's gonna have a healing substat as opposed to the uh, Pigsy one. It just says Maycast Unicorn. But uh, yeah, it, it looks decent. You know, it's kind of same as the uh, Maycast Pigsy Jewel. So if you need a Maycast heal, there you go. Then at tier four, we got the Fiddler. <laughs> What is th <laughs> the Fiddler emote? I, I love that. It's like the imps with the little imps music. I like that. Then we got the Ultimal Imps Remnant, which looks pretty nice. Design wise, it looks pretty cool. All right, it's decent. And then over here, the teleporter effect, the fiddling around with the little imps. <laughs> I like it. it it's a cute. Um, probably won't be buying the Scroll of Fortune. I don't know. Scroll of Fortunes have been kind of like low in quality for me. Oh gosh. Who knows me? Hi. <laughs> I don't know who that is. But what's up? Kane the Ghost of Dust. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> going back to the Fall Scroll of Fortune. Can you please help me and my friend with Bane? Uh, okay, sure. Okay. I guess. Do they really need help with Winter Bane? I get okay. What do I do? Do I just help him? I was in the middle of a video. See, this is why I be in my house doing videos. Alright, I guess we're doing Winter Bane, I guess. <laughs> And if your friend, please come. Friend, please. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, alright. I have a rental vein, so pour it. Okay. Where are we going? Alright, guess what? Guess we're doing winter vein. Forget the video. <laughs> Forget the video, we're doing winter vein, I guess. See, this is why... <laughs> this is exactly why... Exactly why I do not... Whatchamacallit. This is why I don't be in public. <laughs> um... Well, I guess I just wait for them, I guess. Anyway, well, I, at this point, we can't even do the news anymore. <laughs> all you need to know is that there's a new Scroll of Fortune. That's all you need to know, honestly. Like, low-key, though, I don't really like the Scroll of Fortunes. I don't know. I like the ones when they had the, like, a Krogger Maycast jewels, but I don't know. Lately, they've just been kind of lacking in quality for me. And it's usually, like, the same thing. You know, Spellmint, Gold, Nari, some elixirs that you can get. And also, another thing, a lot of people don't really play this game a lot, and they don't really do the Scroll of Fortune or get the points, so... Oh, wait a second. Oh, they're putting a creepy clown car 7-day mount. Okay, that's cool. It's a 4-day mount, by the way. It's a 50% speed 7-day um, mount, so definitely check it out. And if you have a friend, please call them as well. Oh, here they come. Kane. What's up, Kane? <laughs> Look at them explore. A level 9 or something. It's cute. It's cute. I like it. This is super cool. Thanks. Feel free to write any of... 
your other friends. I kind of like showcasing the house to a bunch of low levels. Cute. Oh, so now we got the live with Rebecca. Rebecca Dragonbloom. So we're going to play with Rebecca Dragonbloom and Kane Ghost Dust. I'm pretty sure Winter Bean is going to be capped at like the super, super low level, but you still get like pet snacks and stuff like that. Wait, let me make sure I got my... She's the only friend I have online. Hmm. Let me know when to go in so we can uh, go in. Can I extract Grendel's? Do I? Have, oh my god, no, wait, no, those not imps. Do I? Have, did I not have a Grendel extract? I could have sworn. Now, imp doesn't count, right? Imps doesn't count, right? I can't remember if the imp. No, I don't think imps counts. I could have sworn I saw a Grendel animus extract somewhere in here. I'm just getting old. It's been a long time. It's been a minute. Yeah, I don't think I can collect them. Can we not collect Grendels, man? What? I wanted to collect a Grendel. They should just have, like... I don't know why you just can't extract, like, anything. I'm informing Xerathax, though, a little bit. Let me see. I'm informing a little bit of Xerathax. Yeah, right here. I think the monster animus is needed, or you need to display, uh, make it a treasure card. Alright, ready? Are y'all ready? I'm just gonna go in. Even if it's just us. Yep. It'll be okay. Yeah, it will be okay. I got you guys back. It will be okay. We don't need four people for Winter Bane. I got you guys. It will be super duper easy. Just jump right in. All right, here we go. Winter Band. I guess this is a good opportunity to show you guys some Winter Band gameplay. Everybody's always like, you should show gameplay when you make the news. I'll be like, dude, I literally can't because I always have to look in the crown shop and you can't really open up the crown shop when you're in combat. The only thing you can see in the crown shop while you're in combat is like stuff like uh, potions or minions or henchmen's. That's like the most you'll see, but yeah, these are Grendels. I don't think I can extract Grendels with imps. I don't think they're actually classified as imps. Yeah, these are all capped at the low level, but I should attack now. I shouldn't lollygag because these guys are low levels. I wouldn't want them getting killed. I should probably put some heals in too. Ooh, that's loud. That will wake you up. <laughs> that will definitely wake you up. Well, hey, if you're asleep now, if you were asleep, good morning. We're keeping the volume just like that, too. Hopefully my microphone isn't, like, doing that farting noise. I'm using the Razer Siren X because, literally, I super glued my other... This is what my other headphone is. This is, this is the one microphone I use. The problem, though, is that the stand keeps breaking apart. So I super glued it on, and apparently it fell off again. So, I'm guessing the super glue didn't help, but I'm kind of mad about that. Dang. Yeah. I need to put some. I'm going to put some. Blah, blah, blah. Brandon. going to need Brandon for real, for real. Just in case. I want to try and make this a fun experience for these two. Grendel Vandal. Ooh, I can attack now with this spell. Morgant. Now, this was a good jewel. When this jewel came out, this was a good jewel from the Scroll of Fortune. See, the Scroll of Fortune has some pretty interesting jewels. You just gotta find, like, the right Scroll of Fro Fortunes. But, yeah, I'm not really too impressed with, like, the newer ones. Just because I don't really need the Scroll of Fortunes anymore. They used to have participation trophies in it, which was, like, really valuable, but now you don't even need participation trophies to, uh, craft the revered ones. You bring the 
thunder wizard, I ask you. Oh. Go through the rift the Grendel's tore open and into our ancient. There you will face the malicious laughter of the sorrow maker. Tear thing. Go swiftly, and may victory be yours. All right, going down here. Has the weak need Jarl sent you here into the bowels of the earth? Typhoon. I have turned the Thane's long hall into a house of hatred. Let's see what we got. Eh, I'm pretty good, honestly. I don't really need to pack anything. I mean, basically, basically just one hit these guys. Um. Yeah, I don't really need to pack anything. We just gotta wait for Rebecca to come here. I guess while we wait, we can look a little bit at the uh, special event. Oh, did she come back? Nope. Where did Rebecca go? Five spiritual spellments, two thousand gold, gold boost elixir, three beliefs. Yeah, yeah, it's usually the same thing every time. You know, I'm just I don't know. Oh, that's a cool chair. Small throne. Cool. Spiral Villains Horde Pack. So you get one of those if you have the premium version. Honestly, I have way too many XP boost elixirs, and I don't need any more XP boost elixirs. Uh, what's this? The Autumnal Imps Boots. Ten blueprint tokens. And that ain't gold. Wisteria. Yeah, honestly... Uh, I'm not sure what happened to our... Huh? Oh, okay, then. We can wait for her. We can wait for Rebecca. Where is Rebecca, though? What the heck happened? Rebecca! Oh, she's still there. Oh, she's still there. She's still there. Probably just AFK. She's probably just AFK. Well, in that case, since Kanan's a low level, let me show you. Some, let me show him some stuff. Let me show him some stuff. What you know about this, Kane? Watch this. Whoa, I'm floating in the air. Whoa. Hey. I love impressed. Oh, wow, he wasn't impressed. I don't think Kane was impressed. I don't think Kane was impressed. I love how everybody's been quitting Woods 101. Like, literally, that's just been, like, my whole Twitter timeline is, like, all these threads... Quitting Wizard 101, taking a break, yada yada yada. And upon when I was doing the whole like WizTuber, or when I'm still searching for like WizTubers or like Twitch streamers and stuff like that for like the whole content creator raid, literally people like I'll see like an update on their channel like maybe like a one month ago and they quit Wizard 101. I'm just like, what? Like what happened, bro? And then, yesterday, I looked back on my timeline, apparently Senior Spicy quit, or he's, like, taking a break of Pirate 101. Like, that sucks, man. I, I love that dude. I think he's, like, kind of, like, the main face of, like, Pirate 101. I know my one friend, Frenzy, talks about him a lot, so, yeah, man. But hopefully it all goes well for Senior Spicy, because it's always sad seeing everybody leave the game. Like, for me, I can tolerate it a little bit, but for Pyro 101, it's different, because Pyro 101 hasn't really gotten, like, I don't know, much updates, you know? I know they got in their, like, one previous update, but, I don't know, when it comes to content for both Wizard 101 and Pyro 101, it can be, like, very slow, man. It can be very, very slow. Oh, gosh, wait. Tiefling has, like, 2,000 health. Okay, well, in that case... Oh, I didn't really pack much, I, I guess... I guess we'll just hit. Why not? <laughs> we'll just hit. Wait until I get my AOE up. I did like half as hell. But yeah, everybody's been leaving, man. I don't know what's happening. Honestly, I kind of uh, see of it as a good sign, though, because if a lot of content creators are leaving, though, then maybe it will wake up Wizard 101 at the development team. Uh, yep, that was a wand hit. Yep. That was a wand hit. Yeah, I'm gonna summon in Brandon because uh, my cards are being so bad right now. Brandon's just gonna have to carry this. 
Brandon's just gonna have to carry this. At this point, I'm just kind of flexing in front of these low levels. <laughs> I'm just flexing in front of these low levels, honestly. But, um, yeah, though, if, if people are, you know, quitting the game or they're gonna stop content creation for it, then it should be a wake-up call for kind of Wizard 101 themselves. You know, if they do care a lot to actually, like, do something. Because, honestly, I think this guild update... <laughs> Without you <easy. laughs> Yeah. Oh, this dude must be new to the game. Well, in this case, I'm kind of uh, showing off now. But, um, yeah, though, if people are leaving, it should be a wake-up call. What was I just saying? Oh, I got my shadow pip. Should I definitely flex? I'm gonna flex harder. I'm gonna flex way harder than I have to. Got my boy Brandon in here. Brandon's also flexing. But, yeah, honestly, though, if they do care enough to do something... Oh, yeah, I was talking about the update. Because the guild update... I don't know what happened with the guild update. Like... It was so much fun on test run because we weren't really, like, worried about grinding all this, like, Azoth. And honestly, we thought, like, the amount that was needed on, like, test run would be kind of like a placeholder and they would, like, decrease it. And then, it, like, it comes on live run and it's like, dude, you need, like, so much Azoth to unlock these islands. Like, you definitely need, like, an active type of, like, community or guild group. How long did it take you to reach max level? Ah, uh, not too long. Not too long. I've been playing for years. I've been playing for years, so... I just play the new world. I just play the new worlds. It doesn't take that long to quest in the Wizard 101, only if you make it hard. A lot of people think that it takes forever to level up in the wit. It doesn't really take that long to level up. You just need to do the worlds. That's all you need to do. Oh, now I'm really showing off. Now I'm really showing off. I'm just using everything. It's probably won't do much damage. It'll give everybody a pip. I'm just kind of goofing off in this battle now. I should uh, probably kill the ball. I should probably start attacking before one of them gets like one tapped. Ooh, there you go. And fizzle. Oh no! Can you fizzled? No! Hey, my life girl didn't fizzle, uh, Rebecca. Hey, there you go. Uh, Brandon's gonna also hit. Oh no, he's doing global. Okay, Brandon. You know, there's actually some rare spell that nobody can really cast. I think only like life Brandon or something else, like a pet can, but. Life Brandon can use, like, Eternal Leviathan. Oh, okay, I see. I used to play, but my account got deleted. I don't know how. Ah, I gotcha. Ah, I gotcha. Yeah, it doesn't take too long. Too long. Too long. You can actually gain XP from this whole area. Oh, I got... Dude, my pips. Like, my pips are awful. Like, this is why I don't attack. Look at my pip rating, bro. 33, like, not 33, like 66% uh, pip chance of the meta. I don't care what anybody says. That's the meta right there. 66% pip chance. Like, don't blame me. It's not my fault. Like, the Merciless gear literally has, like, zero pip rating. I don't know if that's a glitch or a bug or if that was intended, but like, yeah, Merciless has like zero pip chance. <laughs> Leprechaun! <laughs> and then Brandon's gonna finish it. Yeah, Brandon's gonna finish it. Also, another cool spell, Sacred Grace, can get it from Aphrodite as a drop. Yeah, I need membership. Yeah, need to get membership ASAP. Yes, you can. Actually, I wouldn't recommend membership as of right now unless the devs want to actually put in some work. Because the guild update, going back to my little tangent, the guild update, I guess a lot of people didn't like the guild update. Like I said, I loved it way more on a test realm than I did on live realm. Because on live realm, it's a lot of work. 
But honestly, if you're working together with your squad, then it shouldn't be too hard. Okay, now I'm killing because my pip chance, this is just embarrassing. I keep forgetting to put my money on my coin. Don't spend money. Don't do it. It ain't worth it. Not for Wiz. Nope. I mean, wait, this is the same game that still has, like, Wizard City is still locked behind paywalls. It's that same game. But, I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't make the game. But, I don't think it's a good business decision if players are leaving. Especially content creators. You know, if they stop streaming Wiz content or they just get burned out. I used to get burned out. I took a break, like, all the way in April. Like, I took a very long break, and then I came back. Why do you keep your cash, though? That's risky. <laughs> I don't put no money on my card. I'm broke. That's why I make videos like this. Oh, I should have skipped it. I should have let you all read the dialogue, my bad. This is my favorite recipe. It is most delicious. It is most delicious. First, put the butter into the stew pot. Put the butter in the stew pot. To brown it. Alright, so butter I in the it. stew pot. I always forget this one. This is like the one puzzle I don't know. So butter in the stew. What else? This is my favorite recipe. First, put the butter into the stew pot. Follow with meat, mushrooms, mushrooms turnips, barley. Okay, I can't remember. I have worst memory. Okay, so meat. Where is meat? And then mushrooms. Mushrooms comes first, right? And then turnips? I'm gonna risk it for a biscuit on turnips. Okay, it was turnips. Oh, gosh. Okay. Now, what were they? Barley or something like that? Yeah, with barley and water. Barley and water. Barley and then water. And then what is it like salt or something like that? Don't touch anything, Rebecca. Don't you dare, girl. Don't do it. Then finish with salt, hot pepper. Salt, hot pepper. Where's the salt? We gotta sprinkle some salt in there. And then what else? Hot pepper. We did it. Did you put something dead in here? <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> Tasty work, wizard. Oh my you gosh. Go beyond and face wretched elixir. It sucks that we don't. It sucks that kind of like the magic for me has kind of sapped away for this game. Unfortunately, as much as I love this game. Like, I can't deny, some of the updates are kind of unnecessary. Like, especially the gold key. Like, I don't... I don't really understand what was the point of the gold key. If anything, it seems kind of like... Whatchamacallit? Ah, oh, what was the word I was looking for? Counter... Counterproductive. Like, counterintuitive. Because now, you're kind of forcing these people another reason why they don't want to play the game. And now you're forcing them... Like, you're forcing them to do all these things that they don't like, you know? I think the whole point, I keep, I mention this all the time in video games, but it's all about like accessibility instead of like exclusivity. I think a lot of people heard me on the channel say that many times before, but it's like, you shouldn't make things exclusive for like only a few people. You should have available options, you know? That's kind of like why I like a few games like Destiny 2. Because you can do a bunch of stuff in Destiny 2. I was playing Destiny 2 last night. I was playing Beyond Light. Like, ugh, be such an awesome campaign, dude. I did Beyond Light in like a single day because I was so interested in the story. Even though I was like very sleepy, I still had fun with Destiny 2. But the thing is about Destiny 2 and like all the support they get like every year is that even though they have paid DLC, you actually get what you're getting in the paid DLC. You know, with Wizard 101, Wizard 101 is one of those old school MMOs where you have to get a membership and then you just kind of have to hope for the best and <laughs> cross your fingers because, dude, so these, this updates are, these updates this year, it's been rough. Like, they're on strike two now. Especially concerning the whole gold skeleton key removal. That was, ugh. 
that was not necessary. And then also going into the fact how raids have seemed a little, com there have been a lot of complaints about raids. Like I talked to Liam on Twitter, or I made a comment on, he said he only got like one gear drop or something like that. Per run. I don't know if that's true or not, but like that's crazy if that is true. If it is like only one gear drop a run or whatever it is, that that's insane. Like I'm consider like I'm reconsidering doing the raids in general. Just because that seems like a lot of work. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, again, I don't make the game. Like, I don't make the game. How is he still at what? Of course. The one boss. Just that little tiny bit of damage. How much health how much health you have? Seven. Of course, it's seven. Actually, yeah. Oh, I was gonna let one of the... Oh, one, one, oh. I was gonna let one of them attack. Seven health, man. Bro, unlucky. Unlucky. There we go. Give everybody a pip. Love the Lemuria spells. But yeah, some of the latest updates, I don't know, man. Spring update wasn't hitting right for me. Especially concerning Spellment. And then it comes with the guild update. I don't know what happened with the guild update. I thought everybody was going to like the guild update, but... Guess everybody's kind of conflicted on it. A wretched Alexorian. My master, Eric or Eric or Axe Breaker. I rain blows of fury upon you and snatch your spirit for the great world. Alright, let's go. Oh, wait, there's three bosses. Oh, one of them is life. Ooh. I'm gonna have to use a uh, heavy hitting spell for this. Let's see. Oh, uh, not too much hell. I should probably blade up first, though. I want to use some other spells, but dude, I'm not getting any shadow pips right now. We'll see how this goes. Or maybe if I got a Forest Lord, because I think I put Forest Lord in my deck. We'll see what happens. Dun, dun, dun. Uh oh. Oh, that's like, that was like the first damage of the entire match. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, both of y'all keep it together. <laughs> don't, don't nothing crazy happen. Keep it together. Oh boy. Alright, let me see what I can do. Honestly, yeah, I'm gonna wait for a shadow. I'm gonna wait. Honestly, I'm just gonna hit with this and bleed. Oh, she got the healing spell, Minor Blessing. Hey, good life wizard. Always carry heals as a life wizard. Always carry heals. But that's kind of like, everybody wants me to attack, but I don't like attacking. Like, I kind of like stopped attacking in like, what was it, Azteca. That's when I found out like my healing potential. Like, ooh, I can heal. Oh boy, Rebecca's getting hurt. And I kind of like made myself a healing build. I saw the new anthem in the raids, and I don't know if it's even worth it. I might just still keep the uh, what you might call it, the Dark Woman's dagger that I have. Like I saw the outgoing. I was like, all right, it's decent outgoing. You know, if it had 20 outgoing, then I definitely farm for it. But mm -mm. not for me. All right, now I'm definitely gonna pop off. Yeah, got the shadow magic spell. Now we popping off for real, for real. Wow. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Skill issue. Skill issue. I should have put stun blocks in, bro. Skill issue. Skill issue. <laughs> oh man. I hope I do get to uh, do the content creator raid again, because I really do love hanging out with everybody, man. The last content creator raid we did was so much fun. I hope we uh, manage to do it again, but it's like, 
I don't know, a lot of people have very uh, mixed reactions with the whole like drop rate situation. And also the fact how school started, so everybody's going back to school. And then also, everybody's quitting Wiz. Like, I don't know what's happening. Everybody's just qu either quitting, leaving, I, I don't know what's going on. I guess everybody has finally kind of got burned out from Wiz. See, that's the thing. I, I think I made a video talking about like how to not get burned out of Wiz. I just, I just made like a wacky thumbnail. Wait, let me see if I can find it real quick. Let me see if I can find it real quick. Cause I could have sworn I made a video about how to reduce burnout. It's actually a good video. I give myself some credit. Give yourself some credit too. Everybody should give themselves some credit. I'm proud of you. I am proud of you. Look at me. I'm proud of you. But let me find this video. My internet is so slow. Oh, this is a spell, y'all. Look at this. This is the spell right here. Like Tarzan up in here. Hey, look at me go. Hey. Oh, she's using the pixie or the fairy. I like that. So Primal Wild Claw. Ooh. Snow Angel, look at that. As a, hmm. You actually get some good stuff out of here. Nice. Congrats. I also got a pet. Yeah, I'm getting a bunch of stuff here. It's pretty cool. Ooh, I got a Reaper treasure card too. Say less. Uh, say less. Uh, say less. I see you there. Uric Axe Breaker. Alright, I am gonna. What you might call it? Alright, this is the part where I just goof around. Because I will not be needed. But, let me see. Put a sanctuary up. I'm so mad what they did about sanctuary. Like, bring me back the 50% or whatever it was at before. Um, what else? I need to start using some treasure cards. I got way too many, like, goofy treasure cards. Um, oh, wait, you know what I should do? I should do monstrology minions. Duh. I should summon in one of my monstrologies. Mandor the Barbarian, I know. Um, maybe Green Man? I don't know. No, wait, I can make Xerathax. I can make a, what's his name? Xerathax. Yeah, I can make him. It doesn't take too hard to farm Xerathax. That was the one complaint I saw about, uh, whatchamacallit. Ooh, reshuffle, reshuffle, reshuffle! Okay, there we go. Always, I tell everybody this, it doesn't matter how small you make your deck, please just carry a reshuffle. I don't know why people don't put in reshuffle. Like, what are you doing? Oh, I got Xerathax. Oh, this is gonna be a fun match. It doesn't take that long with Monstrality. Monstrality's pretty easy. You know, it's just like any type of other farming method, you know? Here we go! There's a new kind of minion right here. Oh, <laughs> snap! Kinda looks like Salvis. <laughs> Nobody knows about Salvis. Only like me and Wolfie know about Salvis. That was a funny video. That was when I was like really toxic. I was really toxic in the game. I still am toxic. It's like, no, I'm kidding. Nah, I'm joking. I'm still toxic. <laughs> oh, the minus 40 AoE choke. Oh, man. Well, I know a Storm Wizard's definitely gonna fizzle. Oh, dang. Ooh, that hurt. Yo, hang, hang in there, Kane. Yo, hang in there, bro. Don't be doing anything too crazy. Oh no. Dang, Kane is getting beat up. Oh man. Nah, Xerathax about to mess him up, you know. Xerathax about to mess him all up. Um, I'm just gonna wait. Oh, Rebecca's healing Kane. Ah, I love it. I miss being a low level wizard. I know everybody's gonna tell me. 
Richard, why don't you just make a new wizard? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Nice. That's good. Rebecca's gonna be a great life wizard someday. I'm calling it. I just know, man. I know a life wizard when I see one. Yo, Xerathax over here with the scorpion. I see you. Yeah, we got 4v4 going on now. Pretty interesting match. But yeah, I get that comment a lot. Be like, why don't you make a new wizard? And I'm just like, no, I'm not I'm not doing that. But why you want me to make a new wizard so bad? You know how many walkthroughs there are out there on YouTube right now? You don't need to watch me. <laughs> you don't need to watch me. This funny thing is, I actually have like a full on unedited caramel walkthrough that I did with Nicole. But I have yet to upload it. It's just been sitting in the drafts. Like, it, we did it right when Caramel released. I think it was on Test Realm. But, dude, I have still to this day have not uploaded that. It's just been sitting in the draft. Like, I'm so lazy that I don't even want to edit it. Like, that's how lazy I am. I don't really edit my videos, honestly. Like, low-key, I just don't edit. And when I do edit, I get, like, super bored. But it's only for Wizard 101. Like, I'm fine editing other videos, like uh, my PlayStation games. I'll edit that on the Share Factory, but when it comes to editing on laptop, I just hate it. I'm just like, dude, I don't got time. I'm just gonna say what I gotta say. I'm not gonna put no fancy 3D, like, spectacular intro and stuff like that. But, um, yeah, I ain't gonna do all that. <laughs> I'm too lazy for all that. It actually, I think it actually takes a little bit more time though to get the video out there. Cause then it has to like process and export. So I think it actually takes a little bit longer. Oh snap, he got the Thunderbird. Oh, he got the Thunderbird card. He got the treasure card. That's what I'm talking about, bro. You, you hit him. You hit him, Kane. You get him. I'm gonna blade up and do a Wings of Fate so I can heal everybody and also do some awesome damage. But yeah, the reason why I'm not making a new character, and I get this comment all the time, the reason why I'm not gonna like make a new character, even though I do have some noob characters, I usually just, they both fizzled? Oh my goodness. They both fizzled. But um, <laughs> fizzles be crazy. Fizzles be crazy, man. But I've been playing on my Richard Unicorn Caller character for like years. Like since like 2011. So like, I don't know. I don't think, I just don't know. I don't have the energy or the driving force. Like, like I said in the beginning, like I said earlier on, like the magic for me for this game is gone. Like it's not coming back. Even with the guilds update, as much as I love the guilds and stuff like that, my magic for the game is not coming back. And I think that's the problem. I see this a lot with people, but I think a lot of people are just like using Wizard 101 as kind of like a nostalgia trip type of thing. Like I'll see people like always remember it. It's like, oh, remember Wizard 101? And then they'll ditch it, and I'm just like, okay, bye. Bye again, you know? But, um, yeah, if Wiz did more marketing, you know, if they did, like, a free membership, they might be able to get some old players back. But it's like whenever they try to get old players back, they leave for the same reason, and that's just those annoying paywalls. Obviously, they're not gonna remove paywalls, and they're not gonna make the whole game free, obviously. I think everybody knows that, but still, though. I don't know. I don't know. It's just sad seeing all these people either quit, leave, take a break, or they're just so busy to the point where, like, it's a dang, that was a big hit. To where the point where they just get burned out of whiz. And personally, for me, like I said, this is, like, my least played game. And the magic for me is gone. It's not gonna. It's not gonna come back. Unfortunately, as much as I love the game developers, I just do not have the energy. Unfortunately, and it's sad. It's very sad. And nothing. Nothing. Whatever they do with the updates, 
Dude, nothing's gonna bring that energy. But the fizzles, Kane. Oh my goodness, Kane. Yo, Kane cannot get a storm spell out of bro. And I try, I try to convince my friends to play this. Chris doesn't play this. Nicole definitely doesn't play this game anymore. What else? I tried getting King Kiki. I gave him a one month membership. He played all the way up until Marleybone. He's usually the type to be AFK a lot, so yeah, I don't think he'll play this game anytime soon, but we got him to like level 30 at least, so you know, it's fun, but it's whatever. It's hard getting new players interested in this game because all of like the beginning worlds are like super boring sometimes. Is it just Storm and do other scrolls fizzle like this? You just have to raise your accuracy. <clears throat> your accuracy. That. No worries. Yeah, you just gotta raise up your accuracy stat. But yeah, a lot of people come back to Wizard 101 and this little nostalgia trip and all that stuff, and you know, then they leave again, you know? I see a lot of low levels, man. I see a lot of low levels streaming and stuff like that. I'm just like, oh. I'm like, oh. What am I doing here in the end game? But it is nice to see players come back, though. It is nice. I just think Wiz needs to do... Dang, that did a lot of damage. Wiz definitely needs to do something new. And not just a new world, because we've seen some of these new worlds, and honestly... Eh. Yeah, we've seen how these new worlds are, you know? Again, like I said, nothing for me, or nothing in this game is gonna bring the magic back for me. Uh-uh. The magic has been gone since, like, 2012 or 13. Oh, they both leveled up to level 10. Look at that. They both leveled up to level 10. Look at that. You are welcome to visit my hall whenever you wish. I <laughs> these monsters will leave us in peace now, eh? Awesome. Awesome. Awesome run. I'm getting some good treasure cards out of this. Congrats on the uh, on, uh, level up. If you ever want to do more gauntlets, let me know. And then I shall dip and disappear into my beautiful rainbow. Oh, I'm still back here. Oopsies. Yay, Rebecca. I love me some life wizards, man. Life wizards are the best. I don't care what anybody says. Life wizards. All right, so now this time, let me appear offline. And then let me go to, actually, let me just go to the guild house. Let me just go to the guild house. It looks so beautiful, but the item limit for the guild house is 50. See, this is why people are leaving Wizard 101. Like, they're not trying hard enough. Like, they're not pushing the boundaries. And whenever it's updates like this, like, why is the item limit only 50? I could have sworn when we were on Test Realm, the item limit was, like, up to, like, 250 or something like that. Like, we were putting everything everywhere. But now that the item limit is just like 50, it's like you can barely put anything on the guild island in the first place. Like, I just don't understand. I think I think maybe if you unlock an additional island, maybe you'll get more item count units or whatever it is. But still, that's just so stupid to me. Like, what are y'all doing? Like, come on, devs. Like, I don't know what upper management is saying, but like, y'all gotta try. You gotta push the boundaries. Like, we're not in 2008 anymore. Like, my gosh. It looks like we're doing pretty well on the Azoth, though, for the uh, Guild Island. Look at that. 1,260 out of 1,440. Definitely awesome. So, yes, the uh, community is helping out. But, yeah, dude, I just don't understand. Like, try. Try. Break the boundaries. Like, I feel like, I feel like we had this conversation so many times ago. And bring back gold skeleton keys in Darkmoor. Like, don't force people to do all these stupid events and stuff like that. Nobody cares, alright? Alright. Alright, that's it for Wiz. I mean, do you guys still do you guys still even care about the Fall Scroll of Fortune? Like, really? Like what what do you want to see? Like what? What? Like you got 33 30 day autumn imp bumper cars. Look. Looks cool, right? Alright. 
I mean, what else do you guys need? Like, what else? More? Oh, God, that's creepy. Oh, gosh. The front of that vehicle is, ugh, scary. Do they have a new pack in here that they are showcasing? Let me see. No, I got the Spiral Villains Horde pack. I don't think there's any new packs that we're getting anytime soon. Yeah, like, do y'all still care about this or whatever is happening? Energy Elixir, the Cathalon Balance Tower pack, Automal Imps Helm. Ooh, the helm is kind of nice. The helm is kind of fire, but I'm not going to buy the premium for it. Because if you uh, don't have a membership, then it's set for 15,000 crowns. And then if you have a membership, it reduces to 7,500 crowns. So your best interest would be to get a membership, then get some crown, then get the Scroll of Fortune. But only get the premium Scroll of Fortune if you're actually going to do the Scroll of Fortune. Like, I get so tired of people, like, sending all these screenshots on Twitter. They're, like, on page one, and I got, like, two days left. I'm like, what were you doing for, like, the 90 days that we had? Like, what were you doing? Now, understandably, you have to know your own schedule. Because if you don't know your own schedule then, well, you know, you're just not gonna make it, but... Yeah, some of this stuff is good. It's just Spellment, you know, same thing. Spellment, the temporary mounts, some reagents, some Beast Moon reagents, some elixirs. Fall Scroll of Fourteen painting. I forgot to check this out. Let me zoom in a little bit. I wish I had a better zoom option. Looks like a pretty cool painting. Yeah, it's a cool painting. Again, like I said, I kind of like the OG School of Fortunes when they had the uh, Maycast Kroger jewels in. Dude, that Maycast Pigsy jewel is like the best thing ever. Major Fishing Luck Elixir. Yeah, this is kind of same stuff. Hades the Unseen Mural. I feel like I have this painting somewhere. I don't know how I got it, but I feel like I have that somewhere. Yeah, you guys can check out the School of Fortune uh, for yourself. But, um, yeah, Pet Pro Miade ends in an hour, so we might as well do stuff with that. Like, might as well, why not? That was what I was here for originally, to level up my pet. Because I wanted to see if my one pet would get the Elemental Scout, or whatever it is. Oh, wait, another thing. There was, I think there was a pet in the School of Fortune. Actually, let me check. Oh, wait, they probably don't even have the pet icon on. Oh my gosh, we gotta scroll through all this. I could have sworn I saw a pet. Somebody sent a screenshot on Twitter. Oh my gosh, seriously, why do they not have a pet icon? Ugh. Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, well, we know it's not the elixirs. No, we know it's not that. No. Okay, so now on page two. I could have sworn I saw the pet. Somebody sent a screenshot of like a pet. Where is it? Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Why would they use a housing? Just put a pet icon there, dude. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is it. The Typhoon Kahuna. Big energy. These are the guaranteed talents. This is something new that they're doing. So, I guess you'll find these pets and they'll have these guaranteed talents. So, um, this is a new thing in the game. This is new. So, you get big energy, you get fishing luck, and you also get elemental retriever. So, those are like the guaranteed like base stats that you get, I guess, when you level it up. So, that's interesting. But, this is basically, this isn't even a reskin. This is like literally the same thing as the Tiki Kahuna. So, they're basically just using the same model for the Tiki Kahuna. And they're renaming it to a Typhoon Kahuna, and I, I guess it's... Uh, dude, I don't know, man. But you get Elemental Retriever for it, which I don't even think I can unlock Elemental Retriever. But, um, whatchamacallit, if you have the pet, because I have Elemental Retriever. Seriously, why did they make that? That actually irks me. Like, why the house icon? Who was gonna see that? Just put it as a pet icon. I don't understand. What? Like, what is going on, man? Let's see if there's anything else in the house icon section. I'm about to go on like a whole tier. Speaking of icons, why do they not have like an icon above Raquel? Ooh, this is cool. Marleybone balloon car. Oh, that's cool. 
I don't even know if that's for decoration or if it's uh, interactive, but it looks cool. Peat, a lot of peat. Fishing scales, and we talked about the impact, looks pretty cool. Decathlon Storm Rune Pack, 15 Spellments, 3 Strengthening Runes, 3 Amber, Triple Animus Elixir, 500 Lunari, um, the Robe, what else, 30 Spellments, um, the Temporary Mounts, 4 to 5 Peat, Myth Draconian, what else, Double Pet XP for 3 hours, got a bunch of Myth Fairy, ooh, this is cool, what is this? <laughs> Imp's Hideaway, that's kind of creeping me out, but it looks cool. Again, this is for the premium pass. You actually have to get the uh, premium scroll fortune to get some of these. One random elixir, and that could be anything. A mega snack pack, because why not? And what else? Some more um, reagents. And then the... And yeah, then the teleport effect. Yeah, honestly, dude, again, I don't do the uh, scroll fortunes anymore. I don't do a scroll of fortunes anymore. But I do want to level up this pet because I do want to see. I do want to see if I will get that elemental retriever. I just want to see. Not elemental retriever. I think it's spiritual retriever or something. I'm not sure what. I'm not sure what retriever this pet has. I can't remember. But I know everybody's trying to go for their retriever talent in order to uh, get the A's off. Dude, I love Goblin Drop. Goblin Drop's my favorite. I played this as a kid. Yo, y'all ever want to play some fun pet games? Yo, play Goblin Drop. Goblin Drop is so much fun. Come on, give me that. Hey, give me that pizza, the tacos. Give me the pizza, the tacos. Oh, we're not even eating healthy. Let me get some fish. Yeah, we are not eating healthy. We're eating a bunch of pizza, fish, more pizza, chicken, a drumstick. We got a taco over here. And there we go. I'm so close. So close. Yeah, it's not that hard to level up Pet Promier. A lot of people just don't want to do it. You just have to have a lot of energy. Chance at Hamster and a random Pet Jewel. We're going to skip the Pet Game over here. Skip Game. Let's see what we get. And... Mmm. Ooh. Not a good pet, man. Got yeah, Earthwalker trained at least, but dude, I don't know, man. I don't think I need Earthwalker, man. Pet, what are you doing, Pet? What are you doing? What you doing, man? I think I can level up this Necrotic Ninja Pig. I honestly don't remember how I got this. I think this is through like Beast Moon or something. Yeah, I think this is through like Beast Moon. Why not level it up? Why not? But technically, if you did play early, you could level up the uh, Scroll of Fortune. Feed that. Yeah, as long as you have energy or you don't garden. I actually do have a garden, but literally I don't do anything with it anymore just because Pet Permeate is so, like, energy heavy. It's very heavy with the energy. Same thing with Cantrips. They should have made it for mana. I don't know what they're doing. See, that's why people are leaving right there. They're not trying enough. They're not trying. As much as I love them, they're not trying, man. You gotta try harder. And let's see what we get. Oh, wait, I still don't have this unlocked? Oh, wait, I'm almost there. Okay. Off of pet happiness. Did we get it? I think we got it now. And I got energy opal. I will keep it. And then that is pretty much it. Yeah, that's pretty much all we can do. And we leveled up a little bit of our false scroll of fortune. And yay, we got lightning bats. See? This is why people are leaving right here. What am I going to use with all of these unused spellments that I don't want? If there was like a conversion system or something like that, I would love that because, dude, I don't need some of these spellments. 
At this point, it's just... Ugh. It looks nasty. I got 81 out of 75 Hephaestus. I could... I could upgrade Hephaestus right now if I wanted to, but I'm not. I'm too lazy for that. I don't even know how I got that many Hephaestus. I think that was through the stone gaze. Dude, so many spellments, man. So many unused spellments, man. Oh my goodness. I only play on one character, too. Ugh. I'm not gonna use any of that stuff. Not using any of that stuff. Uh, what was I gonna say before I left? Nah, that's pretty much it. It's been, dude, we've been here for like a complete hour. Like, this is so sad. Do I really want to upload an hour's worth of video? I don't think I want to. I might just take a nap after this. Upload this later when I'm awake. Do the uh, premiere. Let me go back to my healing gear. Now I look like an awesome wizard. Look at me. Look how cute I am. You're telling me you want me to play a new character out of this, dude? Look how cute I am. I'm adorable. Dude, I'm adorable. I might have to take out the glasses, though. I'm not feeling the glasses, but I like the glasses. I look adorable. Alright, that pretty much wraps it up for the news. We've really been sitting here for like an hour on a whiz. I am all tapped out of whiz. And we got a bunch of stuff that I don't also need. More treasure cards that I don't need. Before I leave, I want to show you um, how to use Elemental Retriever. Or spiritual retriever or balance scout or anything like that so you may find bonus balance reagents pets can only have one adventure talent may find bonus balance reagents so you would just use like any of your pets that have a scout talent and if they have a scout talent then you can basically go around the worlds and you can basically collect um, additional azoth which also counts so I'll show you right now little farming spot not really a farming spot it's not really the best efficient way but nobody usually here anyway in uh marley bone so i think i'll have the whole realm to myself yeah oh dang it's all perfect <laughs> nobody's playing with this early oh my gosh that's the most i've seen it perfect dude dude that's the most i've seen it perfect now i definitely know that there's not that many people playing with can't be that many people playing Wiz. Just can't, man. Just can't. Alright, let's go around here. Show you an example. Keep an eye out for scrap iron. So, with our equipped pet, look at the bottom left hand of the screen. And you'll see this button pop up that says Balance Scout. So, you click on this and troll pick it up. And boom, look at that. Three stone block scrap iron. Yeah, two scrap irons. And also, Azoth. And then you'll be placed on like a two minute cooldown and stuff like that, yada yada yada. Because why not? But it's a nice little neat way to, you know, get some Azoth. Especially if you're a low level or something like that. But pretty cool stuff. Alright, that wraps it up for the, um, the video. Wait, do I have another scout pet? I guess one I had another scout pet. Where is my other scout? Life blade no. Do I not have my other scout? Oh, do I really not have a... Oh, no. This was the only one I unlocked. The troll was the only one I unlocked. I don't have any of, like, the elemental uh, tokens. I don't have any of that. But, again, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Sorry for the long video. I'm debating if I want to upload this or not. But if I do upload this and you're watching it right now, thank you guys so much for listening to me ramble for basically an hour. And yeah, it does suck that everybody's leaving Wiz, but dude, I don't know. They gotta try a little bit harder with these updates. I think what they're trying to do is that they're trying to make people play more, but at the same time, there's a lot of people that just don't have the free time and energy to like soak into Wiz when I could be soaking in more energy and time into something like, what, Destiny 2, Fortnite, something a little bit more worth my time, because honestly, when it comes to Wiz, Wiz is starting to become a chore now, and I feel like a lot of people don't really like that about Wiz, and I can see why people are leaving. Like, I don't blame anybody that's been leaving. Like, I honestly don't blame anyone, because you've been playing the same game for about a decade, and you can get burned out. It can be very tiresome. So, yeah, we just gotta wait and see, um, whatever they do. 
But I don't know, man. I'm pretty much at like two strikes for the updates. Because the spring update, I definitely didn't like the spring update. That was a whole fiasco. And then this update had some mixed reactions as well. Concerning, you know, guilds and stuff like that. Raids and all that fun stuff. Some minor bugs and glitches. But there's always bugs and glitches in the updates. I don't really care about the bugs and glitches. But, yeah. Lots of stuff. Lots of stuff to think about. We'll see what happens in the future. But, yeah. They just gotta try harder at it, man. They gotta try harder with it. But... My name is Richard, you know Corn Crawler. I am gonna go to sleep. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys later and peace out.